and welcome back to Music Freak Gaming. I hope you're having a fabulous day today. This is a very, very fine Thursday, and you are very, very fine too. Is that too much? Might have been too much. Sorry about that. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so I'm back on Tinker World. I'm going to be working on my Guardian Farm, but I had to make a little pit stop. Let me jump over here. So, I've been, I've been over here uh, at the skeleton farm around the mountain because of reasons. Yes, so many reasons. All of the reasons. Um, actually, no, none of the reasons. I just need bone meal. I need a lot of bone meal, and that's why I'm here. So, see, there they go. All the bones and the meals at the same time. Ah, fortunately, I think I should be pretty close to what I need here. Pretty close. Will I be completely close? I don't know. We'll find out. I Because what I really need is about five stacks or so of bone meal. And I have four? Cool. Well, we'll... Um, We'll take some of these bones. We'll see. If this isn't enough, I'll cry and then probably compost some kelp. But, you know, you know how it is. Get your get your kelp fix. <laughs> you have a double one at your base. Also, hey, Snoopers. Welcome, welcome. I may hit you up on it. It's, it's going to depend. I think... I think I'm okay. Quite... Possibly, maybe, perhaps. Also, where the heck is my base? Also, it's probably this is not a, the place to be. All the spoilers in the world. Let's get over here. Just uh, <laughs> We'll just slide in here without anybody noticing. It'll be fine. Ah. So how you doing? Having a, an okay day, you know. <laughs> See, the exclusive previews, right? Um, before I go wandering off, do I have what I need? I think so. All right. Bring some sugar back with me. All right. Um, roof. The roof. The roof. The roof is on fire. Except it's not. It's nice and chill. Hey, Thomas. What a frustrating day. Ah, oh, that's not any fun at all. Let's see, I need to go this way. I mean, I understand how that goes. I mean, I've definitely had my shares of frustration some days. All right, so somewhere. Ah, oh, there we go. Just in time to find my landing strip. It would be cool if you could just whip through the, the portal like that and actually teleport, but no. All right, so step one. Yeah, if I need to, ooh, actually, I probably have composters back at my uh, base camp, but let's just double check if I have any in here. No, but I'm going to bring these logs with me because I have a feeling I may need them. Oh, righto. All right. Let's, uh... Oh, this is going to be fun. Time crunch has not to be disturbed. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've... How the heck? Okay. Yes, I've been there. I've been there many a time. All right, so one of these chests, that one, has some gunpowder. Perfect, because... Okay, let's try this this way. Grab ourselves some paper. Oh, looky what I have over here, too. Yeah. Those couple of witch heads might be helpful for somebody. I don't know who would want witch heads, but somebody may want them. 
All right. Um, I have. There we go. So let's see. I have a box that I was putting rockets in. Let's uh, throw some of those in there. All right. Yes. Yes. All of the witch heads. I think I have another five back at my base too. Yeah, this is, I think this is all totems of undying and a few potions of something. Yeah, fire resist and instant health, but yeah. So yeah, we are definitely happy there. Um, oh. Yeah, okay. Let's put this back in the ender chest before I forget about it and lose it in and amongst all of the other ch uh, shulker boxes I'm about to have. Okay. I need to go east. Yes. East of my worries, sir. Oh, yeah, so I did a little work off uh, camera. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it exists. All right. All right, so let's see. I need a spot to drop off stuff. I have a chest. This is fine. Actually, I should probably find a shulker box to put this in. That's a reasonable shulker. We'll go there. All right. So now... Oh, all right. So, let's see. What is my next step? Uh, What is my next step? Collection system, I think. Okay. I can totally collection system up here. Also, I can grab stuff and things, and more things, and stuff. All right. Do I know what I'm doing? No. Am I going to do it anyway? Yes, yes, that is how this is going to work. <sighs> okay. Actually, you know what? Let's just take this whole shulker box. Okay. Yeah, no, we're not at all confused about anything know everything that's going on and there's zero confusion except for maybe why my rockets won't uh, rocket <sighs> okay I'm gonna swing down here can I land it yes yes I can all right so I'm getting ready I, and I'm really close to getting this guardian farm turned on, but I want to get the collection system in place before the guardians start falling uh, because it turns out it's just nicer that way. I know, weird, right? So what I want to do is I think I want to turn this into a weird collection system of goodness. Now, I want to double check some space back here. Looks like I have some space, which is good. So... Unfortunately, it's really hard to build down in Minecraft. Up is easy. Down is a little bit harder. So we're going to play in this water stream and see if I can get a platform in place that I can start uh, putting things in that I can, you know, stand on. That's standing on blocks is so much fun. Okay. Yeah. This is going to be great. Um, yeah. Yeah. I think, yeah, so th I think these are going to be temporary blocks. So I want to get under that, and I want to get under it by just a little bit. And where's the, do we even have a, nope, apparently not. Cool. So we're going to come out here. Perfect. All right. Yes, this is absolutely a thing. Now. Let's see, I think I can go here and then, yes. All right, so let's meander out this way with our happy little platform. I have no idea if this farm is going to work. Honestly, I am 
hoping it's going to work. I'm marginally confident it's going to work. But the reality is I have zero clue. So we're going to uh, try this together and I don't know. I hope let's let's hope it's it works. All right, so step one is I need droppers. And so let's see. I think I want to come out to here. So we're just going to bring some droppers over and I think I want to do it this way. All right, now this will all make sense in time or it won't make sense at all. And I'm wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised if that were the case. Okay. So right here, uh, three, two, seven, three, that should be good. Three, two, seven, three. All right. I actually do need this to be a, uh, full dealy bob but okay no this is fine it can be cobblestone it's not gonna hurt anything It'll be just peachy all right so next step let's take all of this stone out now all right, now this is going to need to come down this way because of, well, I was going to say raisins. Raisins would be delicious, but also not at all why this needs to come down here. I don't, are you a raisin person? Do you like raisins? All of you out there, chat, are you raisin people? Or are you just, you know, shriveled up and waiting to die on the vine? That is also partially a definition of a raisin person maybe right no I, sorry that got dark just like the night sky I, maybe we should not go there okay honestly i need to block that in but let's not do that you love raisins nice yeah i'm a fan too honestly all right so step one of this adventure is to hop her up. So we're going to just run hoppers all into these droppers. Also, I'm getting a weird audio artifact. I don't know where it's coming from. You'll hear it, that weird whooshing sound. I think I've run into that before and I think I've seen a fix. It's just weird. I was noticing that the other day and I couldn't quite figure out where it was coming from. It is part of, it is something Minecraft related, but beyond that, I do not know. You have no reason not to like them. You're, yes, of course. <laughs> no, I like raisins. Actually, I like a really good oatmeal cookie. Oatmeal cookies are delicious. All right, so now. All right, so that's going to go there like that. You're not hearing it? Okay, yeah, I'm just hearing just occasionally a very quiet, like, whoosh. And it's just bizarre. All right, so let's go and take this out here for a minute. This, this way it'll make life a little bit simpler for me. And I'm all about life being simple for me. Other people, it can be complicated. But for me, for me, I'm all about the simple life. Again, the simple life for, you know, me. All right. So step one, I think, is this. Let's run some blocks this way. Okay, now I don't need all of these blocks here, but it's going to be, it's just going to be easier to build this if I do. 
because what I'm going to need is a, uh, I need a clock. And I'm going to need to trigger those droppers. Again, this is probably the stupidest thing in the world, but I have never claimed to make smart and intelligent redstone decisions. Okay. So, what I need to do is we need to go there. Skip two and go there. Okay, skip two and go here. This is going to use a ridiculous number of repeaters, but... That's okay. We'll be totally peachy, right? Everything will be... Skip two. Everything will be great. Okay, now as soon as I get all of this in place, I'll kind of explain what I'm doing. <clears throat> oh, man, one too many. All right, that's all right. That's fine. Okay, redstone box. There it is. Cool. Well, guess we'll craft up another crafting table because of, you know, all those reasons we were just talking about. Um, all right. So the idea here, the idea is that the guardians are going to drop down here. I'm going to layer this over with uh, campfires, probably soul campfires, actually. So they'll come down here and they'll cook on the fire like fish do. But I need to get the drops someplace and I don't want to deal with massive hopper lines. I don't want to deal with mine carts. So what I'm going to do is each, these hoppers are going to feed down into this dropper, which is going to be powered by... Um, a, a comparator clock or an observer clock fast observer clock right so all of these hopefully will spit out stuff really really fast and i hope i hope it will keep up with the drops if not uh, if not well if not we're just gonna end up with lots of drops what can i say all right so let's do step one of many okay Step one is let's get ourselves some. Well, I was going to get some repeaters, but that's okay. Do I have some plain stone? I do have plain stone. Haha, -ha, perfect. Cool. All right, so now let's get some redstone torches. Perfect. And grab some repeaters. Wonderful. All right. And we're going to try really hard to catch this box. All right. So now the idea here is repeaters. In all honesty, I probably... Actually, I'm going to have to run a row of stuff behind this anyway. So let's just do that. I'm half tempted to cover this all over anyway, because I think guardian farms actually work better if you cover them. I think there's something in the code that says, if you cover a guardian farm, or more to the point, guardians will spawn in more frequently if they're inside. That's what re basically allows them to get all of the... Um, all of the guardians inside the the monument, Dealey Bob. Otherwise, they would all just spawn outside. And as fun as that sounds, you know. Okay, so where are we at here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, we'll repeat her up there. And honestly, I don't know that I need to repeat her up here, actually. This needs to go both directions, but I think we'll test it. We'll test it and see. But first off, there I don't have any pistons in there. And I don't have any iron with me. Oh, lovely. Okay. Cool. 
All right. Well, that's just peachy. Um, all right. So let's go ahead and just bring this here and here. Nope. That's not where that's going to go. Catch it. Ah, darn it. Okay. That'll go. Okay. Like that. All right. Let's, uh, let's go get a craft a piston real quick so that I can make this go fast. That's pointing the wrong way. I am aware. I am totally aware. This, <laughs> I needed a quick cobblestone generator. <laughs> Turns out cobblestone is, is a thing that is needed on occasion. And I didn't have any. So, ooh. let's just throw those in there because I might need it. All right. Let's see, piston. Yes. All right, cool. Oh, it's a long way up. But that is okay. Especially since I'm going to have to fly right back down. In Okay, stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up. All right. <laughs> that was... <clears throat> it's fine. No, everything is fine. Everything is just fine. All right. Actually, this is a good test. Okay, just to make sure that, yeah, that last repeater went off. Okay, cool. All right, so now this guy is going to have to sit. I mean, no, I mean, other than the fact that that's facing the wrong way, it's all good. All right, so that's going to go there. Let's get ourselves our piston. All right. Piston shenanigans. More fun than can be allowed, right? Right. Okay. Um, I have six. I have lever technology. Perfect. Okay. Well, that's not going to be annoying at all. Wonderful. Just leave that there in case we need it. <sighs> All right. So now, anytime stuff gets in there, it should get dropped down onto what's going to be down there. Wonderful. All right. So next thing I need to do is something. There you go. That's the, the secret ingredient. Do something. Also, I somehow managed to make it up here with only one bucket. Ah, okay. Ah, we have more buckets. I I am reveling in the buckets. Now, the other thing I don't have, which would be really awesome to have, would be um things. Yep, those. Uh, no, ice. Ice would be good. I don't have any. It may not matter. Okay. Just saying. It may not matter, but... Okay. But that doesn't mean I don't want it. Okay. Alright, so this is going to be our happy little kill chamber. One should have happy kill chambers. Now I thought about put putting this um putting some bars behind here but I'm a little bit worried about um stuff happening like stuff uh dropping and then getting caught up on the um on the bars so we're going to uh leave this here. Okay. Speaking of leaving things in places Um, torch there. 
don't know that I need a torch there, but we're going to put one there anyway. All right. Cool. So other than not having fire, this should be good. Also, I need to get up there and... Yeah, let's get up here for a minute. I need to fill this in. All right, because the, the guardians are going to wash over this way. I just need to be sure they don't bounce out. That would be really embarrassing. Could you imagine being a guardian? You get whooshed up here into the sky. You're living your best life for about four and a half seconds and then go f falling off, like, out into the... I don't know. Actually, maybe they might be okay. It's like, hey, it's like flying. And then they splash down and save. It's like, wee, let's do it again. But they can't do it again because then they'll fall outside the farm and then they'll be sad. And that would be embarrassing for them too. So, yeah, we'll just keep them in. I think that'll, that'll be safe. Everything will be lovely that way. All right. So I do need to get some water. Let's actually get a third water bucket here. Oh, right, because I did something silly. Um, right. Okay. Yeah, this is a... Uh... I, so, if any of you are watching this and it's thinking, Oh, hey, maybe I'll build this farm myself. Don't build it in the order I've done it. I've totally built it in the wrong order. 100%. This order is wrong, but, you know, we'll, we'll deal with it. Absolutely, because what else am I going to do? All right, so take that now. Because I've got to clean out a bunch of stuff here and a bunch of other stuff and, and stuff and things. All right. All right, so let's drop down now to the collection zone. All right, and that's down here. Cool. So now what we should be able to do is bring this up this way. Okay, now that won't matter. And I need to bring all of the drops right down here and then probably over that way somehow okay again this shouldn't be super difficult i just need to uh do it okay and i'll probably have to bring things down a level and all sorts of fun stuff but okay the nice thing is at least I'm not worried about losing my shulker box in here, right? This seems, okay. Actually, that's probably a good thing to test. All right, we come out to there. Wonderful. All right, nice. So let's go take that out. All right, and we'll uh, bring this down this way. Cool. We're just going to do the old-fashioned gravity works, and we're going to use gravity to our advantage. Okay. Because I like gravity. Yeah. It'll just keep everything flowing nicely here, right? Yes. That... Sorry, I'm... I'm sitting here like double and triple and quadruple checking myself because I, I legit had no clue if this is actually going to work. And I'm kind of wondering if I've done all of this work for nothing. Okay. It's, it is a legitimate concern on my part here. Okay. After this, I think we can drop it, but Okay. See how far this goes and to there. Okay. 
cool. All right. Now, this is going to be... There's a distinct okayness about things that are happening here. So I think what I want to do is... Yeah. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Eight. And then we drop basically right to there. Okay. And we should be well enough lit, but just throw another torch up here anyway. All right. Whew. All right, and then that can stop that. And we're gonna have to deal with water issues. Actually, um, take that back. Let's swim back up here for a minute. I need to do a little bit of cleanup, actually. But let's do that. Let's get the um, let's get the fires in place first. And I'm gonna need about forty-five soul campfires. Okay, because, you know, and I have nine, so we're, we're well on our way. Um, all right. Sure. I do need some sticks, though, so. Stick it up, and soul campfires. That's not nearly enough. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and why do I feel like I'm really out? Oh, because it uses a heck of a lot of logs. Okay, that's a that's heckin' numbers of logs. Awesome. So awesome. All right. Uh, yeah. Forty-five should do it. <sighs> Okay, cool. Let's grab some water. I don't think I'm going to need more, but actually I know I'm going to need more. So we'll grab, grab some here. If I have to build a temporary water source up top, it should be fine. I, for one, am also really glad for the iron farm. That is a lot of iron bars right there. Just, uh, just saying. All right. We can do this. All right, this is the easy part, right? This part I know is going to work, right? What I don't know is going to work is if we're actually going to end up with uh, guardians up here. But if we do they'll uh they'll end up here and they'll end up roasting which is great i might end up getting cooked fish out of this which would be i guess kind of convenient all right so that's gonna have to close off like that really really i mean really okay fine I know, I know. It's just silly this. I almost made buttons. That would have been really awkward. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's go ahead and put that extra campfire in there. Wonderful. All right, so now let's grab our bucket. And we'll come down here. And then I think I can get rid of all of this. All right. So that's going to flow down. We're high enough. This actually takes a surprisingly long time to get to the bottom. Okay, so now, next thing I need to do is we're going to bring some, some of this this way. 
All right, and I might have to drop that down a block. We'll let's kind of see where this water goes. Okay, yep, that's where it stops. So I am going to have to take that down one block. And... Um... Yeah. Okay, actually... Um... Yeah, I could take it down. I Let's actually do this. Sorry, I'm actually a lot. I'm sorry. I'm Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to slap. Whoa, okay. Ow. Mm. That tingled. And not in a good way. You ever have those tingles that's like, nope, that that was not the type of tingle I was looking for right at this moment in my life. Yeah, that's kind of where I'm at now. Do not recommend, by the way. No, not even a little bit. All right. So let's go ahead and hop back up here for a minute. Now, so the idea is we're going to double chest that. I now realized I actually should have put this here. Yeah. So I'm putting the chests in to align the items with, as they drop. Okay. Okay. And now. Okay. Right. That's going to go there. And now can I sneak up? Get a little sneaky block in there. Two, three, four, five. Um, no. Ah, what the heck? We'll build it up here. <laughs> Sorry, I'm I'm confused, but I do need some more. Let's go see if I have more bricks, but that one is not it. If I don't, well, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a little bit of a hodgepodge, but that's okay. All right, so let's see. I've got. Glass, that's almost like bricks, except completely different. Also, hang on just a moment. I'm going to I'm gonna do myself a favor. And I know it's weird. I'm doing something convenient, and I'm not sure I'm okay for this, with this. Okay, um, I'm going to grab a, a little bit of compost. This is the most involved temporary base I've had in a long time. I, mean, I have actual infrastructure happening here, and it's just weird. Okay. All right, so next thing I'm going to do... I know, this is a, a weird divergence, but we're going to do it anyway. Let's get some kelp. And... Basically, what I want to do is I want to start composting some kelp. Just in case I don't actually have enough... Um, I don't have enough bone meal. If I end up with too much bone meal, that's okay. That's not going to hurt anything. I'm okay with that. Alright, just keep an eye on my breathing. I do want to continue to breathe. I know. That's... Uh, seems like breathing is like is overrated sometimes, but no, I'm a fan. All right. I do need to want to be a little bit careful about getting too close to the uh, guardians over there. For now, they're pretty much just letting me be. And that's a good thing. Okay. Yeah, so if I need some more kelp, I can, I can come here and I can grow more. And then I can get some bone meal, and hopefully that'll be enough. This is one of those times where it'd be nice to have an LA. Honestly, getting kelp like this, this is perfect LA usage right here. Is, uh, sure, go down, break it by hand or whatever. 
and then let the as it floats to the top, let the allays skim it off the top and drop it in a composter for you. Or whatever else you need it to go. Just drop it in a hopper and let it go. Yep. Definitely a good good job for allays. I keep threatening to build some allay powered farms. And I just haven't. <laughs> I'm just I just have not gotten there yet. I was almost afraid I was going to have to figure out some form of uh, bone f bone meal farm to make this thing work, but we're okay, I think. All right, so I'm going to compost a bunch of this. I'm actually going to plant a bunch of it right down here, though. Just so it's real close when I want it, right? Congratulations! I've now built a kelp farm. <laughs> oh, my. All right. So that's all going to happen that way. <clears throat> Stuff is going there. I need... Please tell me I actually brought some... Oh, look. A single comparator. Bones. I don't have any quartz on me. <sighs> All right. <clears throat> That's fine. That's fine. I'll just end up having to fly back and get it. No, we're good. Everything is just peachy. Um, right. I'm going to end up having to build an anvil, too. This is cool. Or maybe not. Maybe not. That's just... Actually, I've got in my... Nah, those will be fine. The iron bars will be fine. I just need a filter item. And the iron bars will do it. Come on. I believe I can fly. Alright. I can land on the block so high. All right, so let's see, where are we dropping out of? Right over there. All right, so basically, the items should align with that chest. And I think drop down here. So, that's the plan? No, I'm going to build it up top. That's what I was saying before, and I forgot. Okay. Also, it would be really cool having brought blocks to actually build this out, but it's okay. All right, so... Right, so those are going to align this way, which means... <clears throat> two, three. Now we start getting into the fun stuff. Hopefully. <clears throat> All right, so, right, item filter. I, you know what? I should have just brought that. I'm going to head down there and sleep, and then we're going to uh, I'm gonna bring up that box of iron. Iron is a lovely block. <clears throat> I definitely have lots of it. Okay. Did I actually pick it up? Yes, perfect. I wonder sometimes, you know, like, am I actually going to pick this block up? Maybe. What the definite maybe is happening here. <clears throat> all right. So, all right. That was cool. Very cool. All right. So, let's see now. All right, you know what? This scaffolding needs to move. Okay. It's very fine scaffolding. The finest of scaffolding, in fact. But it needs to move. All right, I think it's going to move over here. All right. 
Nice. Now, as a wise man once said, here's where the fun begins. So, I'm going to bring... All right, so what I'm going to need to filter here is... Okay. Um, weird prismarini, prismarini goodness, right? So I'm going to need stuff. Yep. <laughs> yep. It was used a lot in Star Wars. Episode 4, the Clone Wars, the prequels. It's all over the place. If you have not picked it up already, I do tend to speak in movie quotes. It, it's a thing. All right. So I'm going to need Prismarine. Right? So... Let me drop a crafting table down and just double check some recipes here for a minute. Right, so sea lanterns are prismarine shards and crystals. And then everything else is shards, basically. So the crystals will go there, shards, and then two more shards. Okay, I think I can make that work. And then beyond that, we'll everything will burn okay cool all right so now let's get ourselves there we'll just do it this way filter and i'm gonna have to come back here and reset these filters but once uh once starts stuff starts flowing but that's something i can do after the farm is running I, but I do need to be sure I've got at least some of the collection system in place before I let it loose. Okay? Right. Now. Let's grab some iron. Okay. I already had iron. Alright, so now. Some room. And I really need to tear down all of this stuff. Most of the stuff. Okay. Because this stuff needs to all... Actually, I need to brick in all of this to be sure all the drops make it into the water stream. Uh, yeah, I should... I don't know that I'm going to get a lot of squid in this one. Uh, this, this farm is not exactly built for squid, but I'll throw a, a filter in there. You're right. It's a thing I should probably think about. Again, is it going to be there? I don't know, but we'll see. Let's go ahead. I think this will go out to here anyway. All right. All right, so this will go... Whoops. Okay, so this should flow this way and should stop. So now, let's test this. If I throw a anything in there, it's going to go flying right off the edge, and that is not at all helpful. Um, right. Right. Okay. No, we have a solution. We can make this work. Actually... No, I need this to be a, a chest. It's hard to craft a chest when you don't have any actual uh, blocks here. Um, Right. Let's grab that. Uh, no. Okay. This is probably a mistake, but we're going to do it anyway. Okay. So I think I'm going to need more chest in that, but Oops, hey. Alright, so let's just throw a couple of those blocks in. They hit there, they hit there, and they do get suckered up into the filters. Okay, I think that's actually going to work. Let's just double check so I do need to 
just uh, verify some things, but okay. No, that absolutely worked. Okay, cool. And what happens if it's on the far side over there? All right, we're good. We are just fine. I'm going to pop that. Oops, that's not where that goes. I'm just going to pop this uh, gate up just a little bit. It'll keep... Uh, it probably won't do anything useful, but, you know, it's worth a shot. I can't believe I'm out of stone. All right. Well, no, I guess it's it's a big build. I guess I shouldn't be too surprised. This, yeah, this absolutely, though, has to be built up. Well, my friends, we've come to this part in the stream where I just build out of iron. Okay, and that... Okay, made it into there, made it into there. See, what do you know? The filters actually work. All right, so let's, uh, we'll throw some torches up here. They're completely unnecessary, but we're gonna do it anyway. All right. This just, it's gonna be here to make sure that everything coming out of these droppers makes it into the water stream. I don't want anything in here caught up on blocks or on anything like that, right? The other solution to that would be powdered snow, but uh, I don't have powdered snow, so. And honestly, this works just fine, so. <laughs> yeah, that's... Try to avoid the, the dolphins, right? All right, everything in there. Everything is in there. All right. Okay, cool. So let's uh, get back here. Now, what I need to do is, is we are going to build ourselves some item filters. And I think, does that go, let's hang on. I need to visualize, so there, there, down one, okay. So it was in the right place, okay, cool. All right, and I need to get uh, torches on, but I think I can do that from below. Five, six, six, all right. All right, so that's gonna go like that. Redstone box. Redstone box, which is surprisingly repeater free. Okay. Um, cool. All right, so now let's get ourselves some. Oh no, it's not repeater free. I have repeaters, awesome. I am gonna have to craft up some uh, redstone torches though. I must well turn them all into torches. Okay. If you've never built an impulse SV sorter, they're really easy. If you have the materials to do it, they're really easy. Um, highly recommend if you're doing anything, even if you don't do like complicated redstone or anything like that, they're so useful for just, just about anything that, uh, learning how to just build them real quick. is uh, it's a nice, th nice thing to know. All right. So all of that is going to go away. Cool. Now I do need to get... I need to get comparators. I've got, like I said, the one, which is not uh, not as helpful as it could be. Hey, Carp, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. I hope your day is going well. All right. 
So, yeah, I need to go get some comparators, but... <sighs> okay. Just got home from to being in school for, and worked for 12 hours. That makes for a long day. I do not miss those days, I'll tell you. Okay, I think I've got... Um, I think I've got some netherrack back at my main build area. A little uh, base down there. So, I don't think I need to do anything here. That should drop out nicely into that. Okay. All right, friends, Romans, and countrymen. Um, here's the next question. I did plenty of those while working 911. Yeah. No, 12 hour days are not the most fun in the world. Okay. So here's the question. Do we go get some quartz and finish setting up the filters? Or do we, uh, no, I'm going to go get the quartz. We're going to set up the filters up because it's going to bug me if I don't. And then... This is going to get really chaotic. It is going to be the definition of chaos stream here. And I should not have gone this way. That's okay. I'll sleep first. Working outside in the wind and the rain and stuff. Oh, that's, that's even less fun. All right. I need to go west. All right. We'll take a little side trip. It's going to be fine. Yep, since I managed to completely forget to bring quartz. Normally, I try to keep quartz in my redstone box, but this was not one of those days. And I happy to relax. Well, I hope I can be relaxing. We're going to say we are about to embark on chaos stream here, which is fun, admittedly, but... Yeah. Okay. Because we're going to see just how well this uh, farm is actually going to work. And I'm a little bit afraid of it, if I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. Um, there's a ladder right here. Wonderful. There's actually probably one closer to my portal, but we'll take this one. All right. Now, I know I have quartz in my wee little house here, so let's meander inside. Um, okay. Let's see now. So I'm going to need all the quartz for the repeaters, and... And probably for some other things, too. So, let's see. Okay, there's a little bit of quartz. Let's actually grab those pistons. Okay, I don't... I'm not going to need them right away, but let's get them anyway. Um, all right. Yeah, let's... Let's go ahead and quartz it up, my friends. I get all the quartzy, because... Yeah, I'm going to have to make a number of repeaters plus some comparators and other stuff. So, let's just break down the quartz. This is why I need to build a gold farm. Yes, there is a gold farm on the server. Somebody has a bartering farm, I'm sure, but I always need quartz. All right. All right, cool. So I can, in fact, since I'm over here with a convenient supply of sticks. That's the one, that's the one. All right, let's go ahead and craft up a bunch of, let's just go, go ahead and craft those things up now. Okay. All right, yeah, let's, yeah. No, this is this is gonna make sense, right? Sure, it is. 
Okay, so that's good there. Redstone torches. And... Alright, that should... Yeah, we'll do 25. 25 repeaters should be good. Let's also grab some more stone since I'm right here. And the crafting table is over here. You're right, you know, I know what I'm doing. Contrary to popular belief, I do sometimes know what I'm doing. I know, it's weird. All right, anything else I wanna bring? I could bring some more stone. Yeah, let's bring some more stone. Okay, come on. I can put things down, it's okay. Just, again, since I'm here, let's go ahead and stock up. It's not gonna hurt anything to have it. And if I don't use it, I'll just bring it back and it'll be lovely. Okay. All right, and now, watch as I actually remember to bring the redstone box with me. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Those can be there. All right, the item filters are gonna be the easy parts. Yeah, we're gonna have some things that are gonna be a little bit more complicated. It's going to be, hang on. I'm here, I've got wood handy. Let's get some more wood. Cause I'm gonna have to build um, some crafters and that means crafting tables and that means wood. And I don't know that I have a lot of logs back at my base camp, so. We'll just take a quick, oops, I forgot to bring stuff with me again, moments, and, or at least try to avoid one of those moments. Uh, those, those are important. I like to uh, avoid those. As much as I joke about not planning anything, it's 100% too true. I very rarely plan anything, but every once in a while, I do plan something, and when I do, I like to actually have the stuff that I need. And that's why I spent like half an hour or so before a stream. Uh, yeah, this way. Half an hour or so before a stream um, getting bone meal. Because we are going to need it. The chaos is going to happen and we are 100% going to need all of the bone meal. Going to be weird. All right. East we go. Right, right. Hello, cows. Okay, we got it. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're still flying. We're still flying. Everything's good. All right. Now. All right, let's go ahead and hop up here and finish getting these set up. I so said I'm going to have to reset the filters, but that's okay. All right. All right, so that's going to go there, and that's, so that's lovely. Okay, this is all gonna have to come out here, which is also lovely, but I do wanna set up a second, second row of hoppers pointing down. And then beyond that, yeah, things are gonna get weird, which is okay. All right, let's, okay, again, make sure the dolphins don't get it because it, as was mentioned, dolphins are annoying. All right, so let's get. Okay, let's get just some extra hoppers in. I'll, I'll worry about where those end up pointing later, but for now, they're pointing down. All right, so. Whew. 
All right, so let's see. I've got those in place. Um, so that's set. Water's flowing, except it's not flowing over there yet, and that's fine. Okay. All right. Let's let's see now. I should actually record a clip real quick, and then bring the chaos. Okay, um, yeah, sorting system is in place. It's not completely set up because I need to put in the prismarine bits and bobs that I'm going to get. And also, maybe I'll get lucky enough to get ink sacks. I don't know. But all of this is going to flow over here and I'll and into the sorting system. That is going to go into some other equipment. But first, I think it's time to actually see if this farm is going to work. And, uh... I gotta tell you, I'm a little worried about this. All right, let's uh, let's get over here and do the thing, right now. Step one, I don't need this. Step two, set my spawn someplace close. Okay, step three, we're gonna drop off a bunch of stuff that I don't need. Oops, the sword I probably, honestly, the sword I don't need either, I think, for the next bit here. But, um, do I have a fair amount of dirt here somewhere? I do. That might make this a little bit safer. Um, okay, I'm going to need bone meal and I'm going to need kelp. Okay, so let's... Do I have a say do I have any place where I can put random garbage? Yes, yes I do. Alright, so we're gonna bring a bunch of stuff. So I don't need this whole soil yet. Okay. That's a that's a problem for future me. Okay. Uh right, droppers go in there. All right, so now, basically, I'm just dropping off a number of things so I don't end up... If I inevitably die... Is inevitably an if statement? Probably not. That's probably uh, not exactly what where that goes. But... <sighs> All right, now, we're... This is going to be totally safe and stuff. Yeah, absolutely safe and stuff. All right. Well, what I am not going to need probably is the elytra. The armor is going to get in the way, so I'm going to take that off. I'll leave the elytra in case I do have to make a swift exit, but let's not worry about it at the moment. Now, I'm going to get some kelp in place, and now, yeah. So let's go ahead and do, grab one invisibility potion and leave it here, just in case. All right. So we'll bring that. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and bring the kelp. All right. All right. Here's where things are about to get messy. I need to grow kelp from the bottom of this thing all the way to the top. Now, turns out golden carrots don't help you fly, so we need to avoid that problem. But I also need to avoid getting eaten by all of the, the bad guys here, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to Invis up. Okay. Now. Okay. Come on. I can do it. I can get out of this, right? I can't. Fine. I can go this way. All right. Now. I think to save myself a little bit is I'm going to 
take off the elytra, first of all. And then let's... Uh, let's see, I think... Well, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to... Let's just get some... Ah, okay. Right. That, that's a problem. Let's just get some kelp planted. Hi. Will you get out of the way? Ah, it's like a really annoying dog. All right. We'll just get this kelp in place. And hopefully the... These things just don't see me, right? That's the idea. I want them to not see me. And I can just get kelp planted all in here. And then... Maybe what I can do is get it all bone mealed up the way I need it to. Okay? We're going to try. We're going to try this and hope for the best. All right. Because now I'm doing this so I can get bubble columns, right? That's the That's how all of this works. All right. So now that's going to go right in there. Nope. Nope, not even a Hi. Could you not see me, please? Thank you. Okay. Nope. Alright. Cool. So now... Now we're gonna start getting our kelp. Or getting our kelp. Getting our bone meal. And... All right, now this is going to require a metric ton of bone meal. All right, so. We'll just uh, let this go. All right. And I think I'm being pushed around by a guardian. Yeah, cool. Let's see how... Okay. It's about what I was thinking. All right. <sighs> so much. So much kelp. All right. So much kelp. So much bone meal. And this is going a lot better than I was expecting. Which probably means I'm going to end up dying here real quick. But let's... Oh, that's why I'm not dying. I've got conduit power. Snoopers, you are awesome and amazing for setting that up. Because, hey, breathing is a thing I like to do, and now I can. So, thank you. That is that is awesome. All right. So, here's the trick. we got to get all of this up. <laughs> yeah. Snoopers is awesome. Also, for those of you that apparently Twitch call, name today, um, like, Mod Appreciation Day, and while Snoopers isn't one of my mods, Snooper is a mod for, I know, I know some other people, and I have some great mods in my community as well. So, big shout out to all the mods out there. And I know I'm not on Twitch, but... That doesn't change anything. Big shout out to all the mods out there, because y'all do some amazing work. Okay. It's not the invis potions. Okay. Grow up a little more. I said I'm a little bit worried. If it's using a stack and a half for each of these, It's 22 blocks across. Why? <clears throat> okay. So anyway, 22 blocks across, that's a stack plus, well, stack and a half times 22. All right, so that's 22. That's a lot. Let's just, we'll just go there. It is a lot. <clears throat> Actually, I calculated it out, which said it's, a, which I thought was maybe five stacks of bone meal. Yeah, and I'm gonna have a lot of kelp left over. Well, if I don't get this finished, 
right? If I do run out of kelp, I can break what I have, break what I have, take it back to my composter, right? And just uh, kelp that up or compost that up and maybe get enough uh, bone meal to finish maybe. I'm pretty close. I came out here with four stacks of bone blocks. Which, uh, of course, each stack of bone blocks is nine stacks of bone meal. Okay. Right? So. I think we'll be okay. Yeah. So we're getting there. We'll see. We'll see. It'll be... <laughs> Okay, it's very green. We're good. All the green. Yeah, and I'll need to get up to the top and make sure, before I break all of this kelp, I'll need to get up top and make sure that it is actually all up to the surface. Because I need this to be a water column all the way to the top. So, yeah, it's a... It's a thing, right? Right now, I seem to be, well, I'm invisible, but I don't think the, uh, even what little visibility I have, I think I'm being hidden by stuff, so. So, actually, I'm feeling a lot safer than I was afraid I was going to be. I was afraid I was going to be running for my life here. A lot. <laughs> Feels like I'm being bounced around by somebody. Okay. Might as well get all of that. Okay, hi. That one's done. This one is... Okay. You know, there's a... It's a fish! I'm being bounced around by a fish! See, this is why I say the only good fish comes in stick form. You know, they just, they're, they're stupid. Fish are dumb. <sighs> okay. Anyway, it's okay. <sighs> so yeah, I will, pr whoa, hello. Okay, my invisibility potion has run out. And uh, I would really appreciate it if uh, that, Guardian just totally forgot that I was here. Okay. Just because that's going to be silly and annoying if I, it's not. All right. Those are facing the wrong way. It affects absolutely nothing about the functionality of this. It's just annoying. Okay. Okay, so that's grown. This one is not. Cool. Okay. <sighs> All right. Yeah, get out of the way, Cod. Yep. I mean, I knew building out here with the Guardian Farm was going to be dangerous. I just didn't think I would have to face the wrath of Cod. I didn't. I, I, of all of the things I was figuring I was going to have to face, that was not one of them. I should apologize for that pun. Either to you or the Almighty, I don't know. <clears throat> Somebody needs to repent tonight, I think. That's a... All right. We're getting there. I don't know how far I am because I can't see anything beyond the green sparkles, but. Okay. Oh, but we're getting close. Obviously, it took more than eight minutes to get this far. Also, let's get that other invis potion on my hotbar just in case I need it.
<sighs> well, this, I have to admit, is the most riveting content of all time. Um, we're just going to sit here and watch kelp grow. That's that's how this works, I think. Okay. You know, some people like it's fun and adventure and excitement. You know. But unlike a Jedi, a streamer does sort of crave those things. And this is uh, not it. Speaking of Jedi, I've been watching um, the Clone Wars, or not the Clone Wars, um, the Bad Batch, right? That that new animated, or semi-new, it's in its third season, but that animated show there, and it's been really, really good. I tinkered in a 24-hour AFK fishing stream. Yeah, I, I can see it. No, the Bad Batch has been really good. Um, I've I've long held the opinion that the, some of the best Star Wars is in animation, and the Bad Batch is just continuing that. Uh, okay, I think that's up. If it's not, I'll be able to tap top off the kelp from the top side of things. But yeah, it is. It's been good. There are three episodes left in the season, so there's plenty of time to get caught up, and there's still some, uh, still a couple, said couple of episodes left. But man, it's been good. All right. How much further do I have to go? Oh, we're actually pretty close. We are getting there. It's just this kelp takes roughly forever to uh, to bone meal, but it's okay. Okay. All right. So let's see. So anyway, yeah. So the, the bad batch has been really good. Um, a lot of good good stuff in this episode. Some of it was deep and emotional. Some of it was just good Star Wars action and and adventure stuff. Yeah. All right. It's going to be close. Might make it. <laughs> I was just sort of estimating the amount of bone meal I was going to need. So it's very possible that uh, I overestimated. All right. But this is the last row of kelp, I think. So I'm going to grow this up. And then we're going to go topside and make sure that the kelp all reaches all the way to the top. And then we're going to come down and break it and watch all sorts of fun stuff happen. Okay. So I think we're all grown up. We'll give this a quick... Everything gets a quick double tap as I come by here. All right. I do kind of want to hurry. I've got a, only a couple minutes of conduit power or of uh, invisibility left, so I may need one more potion before I come down here and do. Oh, yep, that's why we did it. Something else was there. Okay, got it. I think. Okay. Ooh, apparently I missed one. All right. And this is why we're, I went back to test. Okay. So we'll keep an eye on that in, in Viz too and make sure that it doesn't uh, end on me before I'm ready. Okay. I think we're good. Good. All right. I think we're good. Awesome. All right. Let's uh, grab a little kelp out of this box. All right, can I can I fly? Yes. Great. Almost out of uh, rockets too, so that's lovely. Okay.
Okay, quick look. This kelp, just making sure that all of the kelp is grown all the way to the top, right? And it looks like we are in good shape, which is fabulous. We also have a thunderstorm, which is less fabulous. Cool, but I think we're about ready to let this sucker loose. All right, so step one of this process okay, is, yeah. Let's take all this dirt out. And I'm gonna have to take this these iron bars out too. Okay, so I'm gonna take these bars out so that the, the water is released. That's what's gonna wash all of our Happy friends. Uh oh. That's that's not good. I guess that's dirt now. Um But that's gonna wash all of our happy friends right down into the chamber of death, right? And oh, hit the fence, not the stone. Okay. And while I like a good chamber of death, um I'm not sure that the uh, guardians are going to. Which is, actually, I'm okay with that. So, let's get all this stuff out. Come on. And then I'll go fix my filters. And we'll let the kelp loose. And we'll see how this goes. Come on, man. Get it together. All right. All right, now, as I said, let's go check those filters because I now just dropped a bunch of stuff in there that shouldn't be in there. Okay, right, this now has a bunch of stuff. Okay, no, no. I'm sort of expecting to see some uh, stone down here, but I guess it didn't fall here. It fell all the way down there. Cool. All right, so we're gonna sleep. I'm gonna restock my rockets because I may want to be flying a little bit more than I am. Okay, restock means take rockets out of the box, not put them in. Okay, nope, I, I know how this works. All right, do I happen to have um, any sort of stone? Perfect. That's going to be useful too. All right. Now, we're going to sleep. I'm going to hit the invis potion and we're going to see how this works. <sighs> okay. Here it is the moment of truth where. Again, we're going to see if this whole mess works. So, take off the elytra for, for a moment. And let's get in here. We'll break all of the kelp. And I want to break it in such a way that I'm not immediately sucked up by the bubble stream. Okay. Okay, no, no, don't, don't bump me. Okay, I think that's a good sign. I think that guardian going up there was good. Um, again, I want to, I just want to be sure that I don't get sucked up until I'm ready, right? That would be, uh, okay, yep, that's what I'm trying to avoid, okay. No, 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 please don't, please don't, I've got, okay, okay, we're getting there. This is the last... Last one. Okay. No, 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 no. <sighs> Remember what I said about before I'm ready? Yeah, that's kind of where we're at now. That was the whole before I'm ready. Um, Cool. Let's see if I can get out of here without dying. Because that would be awesome. Uh, <laughs> Do I have a block? I do have a block. Cool. We'll just uh, get out this way. And it'll be great. <sighs> I just need to get that last, that last kelp block out of there. Right? 
And... No, no! I think I got it. I think I got it. Okay. Ah, so up to the top we go. And... Yeah, I'll, I'll need to go and double check my filters again because... So I just ended up with a lot of kelp and stuff up here. Ah, jeez, monkeys! Okay, filters. Yes, I, um... I'll check those since I'm right here and able to fly straight and stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah. Lots of kelp. Okay, so kelp, kelp, kelp. Okay, that goes away. That goes away. Okay, prismarine shard actually is fine there. That is not. All right, and this is lots of extra kelp. Cool. All right, so let's just so it doesn't get caught up in the hopper again. All right, prismarine. Okay, I think that's good. So, oh, that is a problem. Okay. Not an insurmountable one, just an annoying one. Okay, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need my box of uh, iron fences. Okay, and I'm gonna, let's just compost that kelp, okay? All right, now that should be fine. I've got that stuff, I've got four minutes of invisibility. Let's do the thing. All right, so, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. So they're getting caught there. All right, cool. So let's, let's take this out. Honestly, I'm not 100% sure. Yeah. Okay. Okay, no, please don't. Don't with the shooty shooty. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to have to take my elytra off, I think. Okay. Let's just hop. Come on. Stop swimming. Please stop swimming. I'm not Dory. I don't need to just keep swimming. Okay? We're fine. We're fine. Okay. And that's going to live there until I get things out. All right. Okay. Okay. Okay, yeah, this is, I think this is all going to work, but I have to get all of this stuff out here first. And I think I saw one of those uh, guardians go launching into the stratosphere. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the, the big kicker here is that Guardians can, um, they can swim, right? So they, in a lot of ways, they can avoid the, some of the stuff here. But that's not where that goes. Okay. All right, so now, all right, so I've, I've replaced that row of stone with the uh, iron bars because they were, the Guardians were getting caught underneath it. And the next thing I want to do is go and take that out. And I want to put a row of stone brick right along the top here. This is going to keep the guardians from getting launched by the bubble columns. And keep them right here in the water where they can then get pushed out into the rest of the farm. And hopefully, won't have to worry about uh, some guardian seeing me and yeeting me off into the wherever it is they want to yeet me off to. Yeah, see, this is... One concern I have is that, you know, they can fight the current, but I think they do eventually end up down here becoming, you know, barbecued fish, which, again, I'm okay with. As long as I don't have to eat it, I'm totally okay with it. Whoa! Okay, turns out... I was not wearing my elytra. I'm, I'm kind of glad there was water all around. Let's get out of here before the killer fish see me. All right. 
Yep, I need to come come up here and check my filters. Because I said I think I've got lots of just random garbage in here at the moment. Yeah. Cod needs to not be there. Alright, that needs to not be there. Alright, the dirt. Okay, crystals I do want. I want the crystals here. This'll be prismarine. That's prismarine. That's prismarine. And this last one is prismarine. And then this one will be squid, probably. All right. Nice. So let's head over here. Now, right over here is my AFK spot. Okay. It's not safe yet, but for now. <sighs> so theoretically, this AFK spot should be enough to keep the Guardian spawns limited to this area, mostly under here, okay? Now, you can see if a bunch of them are hanging out, we're gonna solve that problem in a minute, okay? But for now, the squids that are making it up here, like that one, they're whooshing up the water, okay? And then slowly, but eventually making it into the fire, okay? And they may fight it, but, you know, you can't fight death. Eventually, it comes for you. Okay. Cool. So, the next thing in our uh, lovely stretch of chaos is I need to layer that whole area down there. All of the, all the ground underneath my farm with soul sand. So, let's get prepped and go layer in some soul sand. All right. Yeah, this is going to be lovely. Okay. And again, conduit power may be my friend here. Not entirely sure, but we're going to see. The water bottle. In fact, let's... Everybody drink some water. If you're thirsty, grab some water. Okay. All right. I'm going to grab some invis potions. I don't need the block of coal. <laughs> All right. Now, what the plan is... Boy, that's it, huh? Turns out kelp doesn't compost very well. All right. Well, that's fine. Totally fine. All right. So that's all going to go. That can go in there, too. I don't need the torch. But what I do need is a lot of soul sand. A lot of soul sand. Oh, I have an ink sack. Nice. Let me go set that filter real quick while I'm thinking about it. And then, down we go. In fact, this is dangerous enough. I may want to leave my elytra back at my base and float over. Okay. All right, so now, yeah. Because I'm not going to be fighting my way out of any of this, so. Leave the, the shovel because I'm probably going to need that. The cod ends up raw. That's annoying, but not surprising. All right. Got the soul sand. Got some invis potions. Um, and now I have a boat. Perfect. Okay. Well, let's sleep. And see if I can make this work. Oh, yeah. Okay. I don't want to get too far. Now, hang on a sec. I need to double check some coordinates before I get close. That is 3294 and 801. But I actually need to come over. So 3094 and 802. 3294 and 802. Okay. All right. Well, here we go. 
All right, so 3094 and 802 is 9494 nine, right there. Okay, and with this is going to come all the way across this way. Take the scaffolding out. And this is going to come all the way over here. Um, actually, except for this middle block right there. Okay. That needs to not be there. Because I don't want to accidentally... Uh, I really don't want the Guardians blowing up into... Okay, that's... 8.15. That's 8.15. Okay. I don't want the Guardians blowing up into the... Um, that center area. Okay. Okay, so we'll just uh, bring this this way. And hope that the guardians are not paying attention to me. Good news is we're far enough. And we've got invis visibility potions, right? They're not spawning around me because of, you know, spawning rules. Yeah, so hopefully this is good. I'm almost afraid to say this is going well, but... Uh, yeah. There's a little bit of a issue. Same problem is I've got a bunch of slabs under the um, some of that stuff up there. I would really rather not push the fish up into it. Right, I don't want them to get trapped under the slabs. I want them to happily blow up through the scaffolding and end up um, someplace safe. Like the top of the tower. Okay. You know, I'm just going to pull that out. Doesn't matter. I said, it seems like they're more or less leaving me alone, which is a good thing. Okay, I don't know if the conduit is helping with that any, or if it's just because I'm invisible. Either of those things are fine. Okay. And you don't have to take down the, the temple, which is the... The really annoying part of most guardian farms is getting the uh, temple done. Okay. Four minutes. Right, because that's... It's annoying, right? It's a lot of pointless digging, and... I'm not sure. It, it makes sense in some ways, right? You clean this area out. And so you don't get guardians spawning in there, right? All that good stuff, but how far out do I need to go? This is, hang on, uh, 3273 and 801. 3273 and 801. 327, 3273. Okay. That one actually should not be there. Okay. Awesome. And is that? Yeah, that's fine. All right. Yeah, so we've got, of course, all the scaffolding from when I was building this, this uh, happy little place. Okay. Actually, this should be right... That, that's not at all what I wanted. That can go there. That's can go there. And then this, a lot of this stuff can actually come out because of, again, where those slabs are. And I think that one. Cool. All right. And now let's continue getting this built across. Again, surprisingly peaceful. 
he says before he puts another invis potion in his hand and for when that potion runs out. Okay. Okay, yep. And just take break all the grass and stuff, right? So nothing too crazy. But yeah, we're getting we're getting really close here. Okay. Honestly, don't know if I need to deal with that space down there, but it's okay. Okay. Take, take those out. And it looks like I've got just a couple more rows, so... We are in... We're in good shape here. This is... This is awesome. Um... And I might have a couple of blocks up there, too, that I'm... All right. Wonderful. All right. That is all done. Let's let's beat feet and get out of here before the Guardians know we're here. And then we'll go check the up at the spawning area, and we'll just see how well this works. Come on, get in the boat. Oh. Okay, right, I left my elytra in the box. In my inner chest. Okay. Okay, yeah. All right, that took a lot less uh, soul sand than I was expecting, but I'm okay with that. And yes, I do need to make this safe as well, but. Okay, so look at that. Look at all of those happy little guardians flopping their way up here. Now, the good news is they're going to help push each other right out of the water, right? And down into the fire, right? We are very much talking crab pot politics here. They're just going to pull each other down into the flaming goodness. And yeah, right. You can see all of the stuff flowing across now, right? The uh, the fish are stuck, but who cares? And everything else should just end up getting sorted. Oh, this is wonderful, right? And this is why I'm doing this, right? For all of those happy drops. Oh, it worked. It worked, man. I got to tell you, I am shocked. I am shocked this is working as well as it is, right? It's it's a one-dimensional farm. I'm not using the nether, but it looks like oh, look at all those happy squid squid um guardians. Yes, this is what this is. I love it. Oh. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, okay. We uh Progress was made. Now, as I come over here, it's gonna the rates are gonna die, but that's okay. Sweet. All right. Oh, thanks, man. I'm right. So I've got lots of now. That's a little bit of a concern. Okay. Oops. I'm picking up everything. All right. So that's there. Get that. So everything should flow through here. And yeah, I've got the fish. So what I'll do is I'll set up uh, some nether rack and some fire so all of the fish burn. But I am getting a little bit of some stuff here stuck. So it would be kind of nice if I had some ice. Though it shouldn't matter. Okay, but... That's awesome. Right, so we're... Kelp can come out of that. So, yeah. This is good. So, now comes the fun part. Is 
we get to do some more redstone. And that's yeah, absolutely the fun part. All right, so, wow. Oh man, this is <laughs> this is cool. All right. So, first thing I'm going to need, oops, is apparently to launch a rocket or a couple of rockets. That's cool. Um, right. Redstone box. Now, I'm also going to need a couple more crafters. There's a nice biome south of Thule's Thule's iron farm. Okay. Awesome. So that that's definitely going to be something I'm going to have to uh, look into. So, all right. So now, crafter. Crafter is annoying because it's lots of bits and bobs, right? Iron, redstone, droppers. Okay. Cool. So I have I have droppers. Heck, I've got a couple of crafters even. All right. So, but I'm going to need more than I've got. So I've got crafters. Let's grab the iron. One of these boxes had iron in it. That one. Cool. All right. And we need some redstone, obviously. Oops. Try that the other way. All right. Because we're going to need some more crafters. Droppers, redstone, craft. Oh. What am I missing? Oh, the redstone dust. I didn't dust it. Okay, yep. Dustification is a thing. All right. Cool. And now, do I have... I do have some comparators, which is good. I've got some hoppers, which is also good. Though, let's make some more. Also, I'm going to need to make some chests and a couple of things anyway. Awesome. All right. So, I think... All right. So what I'm going to have to do is bring a bunch of things down. Yeah. Okay. Let's go and craft up a few more hoppers just to be on the safe side. Okay. Yay. All right. And do I have, yeah, I've got stuff I can make. Um, I don't have any cobblestone in there. Hang on, let's grab a little cobblestone. Yep. <laughs> I said I needed cobblestone. This is why, right? I needed it for um, some redstone, like for droppers, right? I needed some cobblestone for that. I needed it for pistons. I need it for... Um, Lots of good stuff. So, right, comparators and observers. Not comparators because they use regular stone, but um, observers need cobblestone. So, that is great. Also, yeah. Hey, White Top, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Glad you can make it. Let's grab a few more these perfect all right now let's oh this is cool going pretty good awesome yeah see check this out oh yeah we are we are having all the guardians fun, fun here today <laughs> all right now said that the rates disappear <laughs> when I come over here, but I mean, I, I still get a few, but not nearly as many because they're spawning elsewhere. Oh, actually, I do need to be here. So, 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 and also, so, you know what? Should have just brought that box of iron. So, yeah, I'm. I'm excited <laughs> and surprised. You know, this is the first time I've built a guardian farm with my own. What am I stuck on? 
Okay, it's the first time I've built a guardian farm with my own design, so... Uh, that's the one. Which, uh... Said, surprisingly, it works! Also surprisingly, or perhaps unsurprisingly, I forgot to bring the rest of my tools with me. Oh, no, I didn't. There they are. Okay, cool. Yeah, so it is... It's fun. Right? Sure. Did I copy somebody else's farm for a couple of other things? Yeah, sure. But not this one. This is... Now, the base is sort of inspired by ENX04 with the idea that, hey, don't dig out the the thing, right? There's no need to drain the ocean monument. Just set up set wherever you're standing to focus the guardian spawns in that area and then push them up with water columns. And that's so that's kind of what I did. All right. So now again, just to be on the safe side, even though it's not really necessary right now, I am going to go ahead and put a uh, put a little bit of a space up here. I don't have any. Um, oops, that's not what I was looking for. I was just looking to see if this was going to be uh, spawnable. Light levels are fine, so okay, cool. So yeah, they uh oh, they're having a grand old time in there. All right, so now let's talk about fish. So, what I need to do is or more specifically I need to talk about prismarine. All right, so that's all going to come down this way. So, what I need to do is make sure that the prismarine is well, it's loading into a uh, crafter the right way. Um, that I might have to look up. Why is that? Oh, just because I'm I'm just looking at it weird. Okay, that's fine. Um, okay, did I bring chess with me? Yes, I did. So let's do, yeah, let's do the, the simple ones first and then I'll need to figure out the others here, but. Okay, so that's, those are locked. If I put, okay, all right, so let's see. Let's hop up here and, oh, okay, I've got the, got those on, all right. Sorry, I'm not thinking in complete sentences. It happens. So basically what I need to do is I'm going to need to put some hoppers out this way because I need to basically where those that's that's a dropper. Kind of where all of that is. I'm going to have to that's where the um crafters are going to go. Okay? And let's see, I think definitely see. So these two are going to be, yeah, that's a, that's a little bit of a problem. I think I might have to, I think I might have a solution for that though. I think this was the same problem. I think Redneck was having when he was working on his um, uh, trading hall things were sort of getting stuck. I think that's kind of what I'm seeing here. So. Yeah, we'll just do it this way. I think that'll work. Okay, take that out. Yeah, see, it's, I think they're still getting, oops, I need to not be there. that way Wow all right no we are definitely having issues here okay um, right let's pick that up 
Also, make sure I didn't drop one in the filter, which I did, which is great, but okay. All right, so that's not... That's not going to work. Darn. And there goes my redstone. Awesome. Okay, remember, friends, dry redstone is good redstone. All right, fortunately, it didn't wash out very far, so we're okay. Yeah, that's... Man, that's annoying. Okay. Actually, what I might be able to do is if I were to take that one off, oops, pickaxe, and extend it that way, that might... Pickaxe. There we go. There we go. There we go. So cobble with hoppers? No. No, that would be a problem. Um, no, because this is all set up for the item filters. We're fine. The um, It's just a matter of making sure that stuff is lining up correctly. And what was happening is it was coming over here and pushing too far this way. So it was actually getting caught in the hoppers a little bit. So by extending these chests out, it helps keep things aligned all the way over. See, I could run chests all the way across all the, the tops of those hoppers, and it would be fine. Honey blocks would be good too, right? Um, I mean, I could go buy some honey blocks, and that, that will so, uh, fill the same purpose, right? Is it Because they're not a full block, the items run partly in the water stream and partly over the hoppers. So... That's awesome. Also, I'm getting so much cod. But yeah, it looks like looks like we're good. I think we're avoiding the... Oh yeah, we're getting lots of prismarine here too. So, perfect. Alright. So I think what I want to do is... Actually, maybe give myself a little bit of... Do I need storage? No, I don't need storage. Okay. What I do need is to get back up here. All right. So, these guys might need some storage. Okay. Right. And, yeah, that's fine. So, put storage here and here. I. Don't need this. Yeah, I'm just changing what I was thinking. It's all good. Okay. Yeah, now this is fine. This will give me uh, some buffer space for all of the uh, crafty goodness that's about to happen. Okay. Well, that was almost in the right place. It's okay. Cool. Cool. So now we should start seeing, yeah, stuff will start dropping in there eventually. It'll be a little slow, but that's okay. All right, so now what I need is a crafter, which is going to point, I don't know, I want it to point down? I've got to, all right. No, so this, yeah, okay, so this guy and this guy are both going to be doing the same thing. So, let's get those hoppers. So, these ones are easy. One of these, that can be nine, okay, and that can be four. All right, and now, over here, see, I don't think I even need a fast observer clock. I think a slow clock will work, because they're just, uh, which is good, because I only have the two observers. That's wonderful. All right, yeah, because the, the stuff is going to be coming in slow enough. I don't think it's going to matter. Okay, so that's going to go there. 
and this one's going to go there, and oops, that's not facing the right way at all. All right. Okay. Wonderful. I can't open those, but hey, it, it's great. Um, yeah. Good idea. Bad execution. Okay. Um, right. I suppose the other thing that would be nice would be to... Uh, Yeah, no, this is fine. Let's do it this way. It's not that big a deal. All right. I mean, I could put barrels and hoppers and stuff there too, but cool. So that will give us all the prismarine goodness. Um, yeah. Okay. Am I stuck? No. I'm, there's no nothing here that stops this, so if it overloads, it's just going to be spitting stuff everywhere, uh, which is perhaps not quite how I want to do this. Um, that's really simple, but I think I'm going to have to not be simple. I want to be simple, but... Okay, we'll, we'll do it this way. All right, so now... Do comparators. Um, right. And all right. Hang on. Grab some redstone. Right. Yeah, I think. Now, see, what ha needs to happen is I need to lock this hopper when uh, when this chest is full. <laughs> All right, this is maybe not going to be as simple as I was hoping. I was sort of hoping for something a little easier, but... Okay. Um... Right. Right. So, um, oh, this is an interesting idea. Okay. That's, did I get stuff in the wrong place? Nope, I think I just might have dropped it. All right. Cool, so that'll just drop in and everything will be great. Um, redstone on camera is the best thing ever. Okay, so. Okay, how do I want to do this? Also, I should double check and just make sure that that does drain properly. Yeah. Um. Hi. Oh, right. The hopper's underneath. Can't do it that way. If you put hoppers underneath, they suck everything out of the system. Right. My bad. I forgot. All right. Well, this is going to have to be something I figure out in the quiet hours as I uh, do all sorts of craziness to make this work. But I can absolutely do it. It just means, okay, I can, because I can, the crafters can go facing down, right? I mean, that's fine. Um, it's just a, uh, just means I can't open those chests, which is, which is okay. I mean, I can deal with that. Or as I put something like a, <clears throat> I could put a dispenser or a barrel and let that drain into these guys. That would be fine. Okay, just take this out. 
Do I have logs on me? I don't think so. I left them all down there. All right, cool. Well, that's craziness, but the farm works. So, oh, this is seriously cool. I have to admit, this is seriously cool. It's, is it the fastest farm in the world? Probably not, but oh, this is great. Plus I need to, uh, I should get a, um, build another portal up here too. Oh, but look at that. Oh, we're gonna have so much prismarine when I get this done. It's gonna be cool. But, in the meantime, while we're waiting for that to happen, I think I'm gonna go ahead and log off. Uh, yeah, it, it's fast enough, right? Is it perfect? No, but it's definitely, it's definitely doing okay. I mean, just watch those guys make that, uh, that lovely climb up there and yeah, it'll, it'll work, okay? Said not the fastest farm potentially, but it's a one-dimensional farm, so I don't have to worry about oh, there's somebody in the nether, and now my farm doesn't work, right? I don't want to have to deal with that. Nope, I just have all of those happy guardians coming up, giving me all the happy drops, and cool. So yeah, I just need to deal with that redstone and also burn all of the fish. <laughs> that that's probably a thing that should happen but that's a problem for future me and it's how close do we want to get is this close enough are we okay here are we friends maybe okay anyway oh oops that's the wrong button this one this is the right button oh, oh man but it works it works I'm gonna when I get all of the redstone in place, I'm going to be selling um, sea lanterns and prismarine in my shop. So, yay! Um, so, but thank you all for being here. It's been awesome. Also, uh, check out musicfreegaming.com for to celebrate having hit 5,000 subscribers here on YouTube. If you go to musicfreegaming.com and use the code YT5000, it's in the chat up there a little bit with code YT5000, you get 10% off a membership that gives you some behind the scenes access, early access to the blogs, um, discounts on merch. Yes, yes, that is also a thing. So check that out. And until next time, be excellent to each other. And this is Music Free Gaming signing off.